Welcome back, folks, to more Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. I am back here again because we haven't got our reward for getting all those Skull Toolers. So we might as well go and do that now. We got all 100 Skull Toolers, so let's go and uh, fully break the curse. You can see everyone's okay now. Hurrah! Since you've destroyed 100 spiders of the curse, the curse on me has been broken. Thank you. Here is a token of my appreciation. Please take it. Oh, what's it going to be? It's going to be like an amazing weapon, amazing armor. It's going to be amazing. It's... Well, thanks for that. It's a huge rupee. That's it. I just get loads of money. Well, I guess they are a rich family, so I guess that counts. But still, come on. All right, so before we go back to Ganon's castle, what we're going to do um, is we're going to fill up our current uh, bottles uh, because we kind of need to. Uh, so we are going to be going to the potion shop here. Now, you could use fairies, but we're going to be needing a lot of magic in this, uh, in this bit. So what we're going to want to do is we are going to want to yep, go down. Here, avoid the hole, obviously. Uh, but we're going to want to go to a specific area to get ourselves something called the Ultimate Potion. Uh, these are blue potions. And uh, what they do is they restore your health and your magic. They're very useful. So we'll just have a chat with uh, you here. Ultimate Potion? How about 100 rupees? Sure. I'll do that. Yeah, blue potion. And I'll buy a second one. There we go. So now all of our uh, bottles have been filled. Very nice. Anyway, back to Ganon's castle. Alright guys, we are back inside Ganon's castle. And now, it's the final bit of the game, folks. We just gotta scale Ganon's castle. Do everything we need to. Avoid BMOs, because no one cares about them. And, uh, you know, survive. So, as we can see here, there is a barrier blocking Ganon's castle. Which is a bit annoying, really. Um, we need to uh, block... We need to pretty much prevent or stop all these barriers. So... There is usually a, uh, a system that people work on. Um, uh, I've also got a system, and uh, the first one really we're going to want to do is the shadow area first. Uh, mostly because it does give us uh, the, I guess this is a dungeon, it'd be the dungeon item. So, let's go and uh, do this one first. So, there's uh, this area, I guess. Great. But yeah, so in this area there are torches here. Uh, which we're going to have to use fire arrows on. So immediately we are using not only our arrows, but we're also using fire. So there we go. And we're going to want to use the fire arrows. And I missed. Come on. There you go. And I think... Hmm... I think probably for this, the best thing to do would be to use the hover boots. So let's use the good old-fashioned hover boots here. Just so we can avoid everything. Yeah! And kill the light light, because sod him. There we go, he's dead. Sod you. Oh, hey! You weren't supposed to attack me! I thought you died in one hit. No, not my tunic! I'm naked now! Give, give it back. Give it back! Get! Give me back my lovely tunic. I like that tunic. Thank you. I had a lot of money from that, uh, from that light light there as well. That's pretty good. Anyway, so we've made it to this area, but there are still other things we can do. We can smash these pots if we want to. What's in there? Magic. That's actually pretty useful for the moment. Alright, we're gonna want to, again, shoot at that. Miss again. God damn it, I'm just bad at this. Oh, come on! I can't hit it from here! Oh, that sucks. Alright, let's try the other one then. There is another one. I think it might be over there or something. Uh, can't really see it from here. Is it over there? Nope. God, this is awful already so far. The only one I can hit is that one. Thank you! Now... Run, Link! Run! With your hover boots. Alright, then we'll hover over here. 
Press the switch! Alright, so, there's a chest over there. We're gonna want a long shot to the chest. Oh, I can hit it. There we go. Hit it. Yeah. And uh, with that, we can open our lovely, lovely chest. This is the reason why you're supposed to do this, well, most people do this one first, is because of the golden gauntlets, obviously. You can feel enough, you can feel even more power coursing through your arms. Grab with A and lift stuff up. Damn right. But not only lift stuff up, but be awesome while lifting it. Because Link is now a beefcake. Alright, we're going to want to get that switch over there, so let's give this a go. I failed. Dang it! And I'm back at the start again. Ah! Alright. You better not fluff this up, please. God damn it. Go, Link. Go, Link, 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 go, Link. Go, Link. Hurry up. Hurry up. Avoid the light like. Murder the light like. There we go. What are you going to give me? Rupees? Because you're boring. Yup. Alright. Well. Nothing in there because that was magic before. I get it. I get it. That's a bit annoying. No! I needed those! Damn it! I needed those arrows! I'm... Missed a Man, I, t oh, I need a new, I need a new GameCube controller. This one is just not going well for me, is it? Uh, first one, and we're already struggling. Thank you. Go, Link. Run. Run. Run some more. Okay, how am I supposed to get on there then? Got a long shot to it. I'm fairly certain of that much. Let's try it again. Go! I could just cannot make it there. Huh. Oh, hang on. I, I remember. God damn it. Like, why am I so bad at this? It's the final bit. Why am I so bad? Also, I'm happy you didn't try and kill me there. I'm very happy about that. Start off like like. No one like likes you. Damn it. Sod you! Sod off! Go away! Sod off! Get the soldery, you! Horrible thing! Alright. Would be nice if you gave me some actual quivers. That'd be cool. Alright. I'm hitting it straight on! There we go. That's how you do it. Okay. Now, run! Okay. I, I, I remember now. I'm an idiot. What you actually need to do is use... The lens of truth here. I completely forgot about that. Actually, I'll pop it there. And we'll pop the hook shot here. Which will use up even more magic. But there is a certain path we can take. We are not going to want to use, obviously, the hover boots because traction. So, Kikiri boots will do just fine. It's a very narrow path we need to take here. And I do not want to faff this up. I didn't faff it up. Hurrah. Okay. So, obviously with this, we are going to need to smack it. Specifically with the Megaton Hammer. Boom! And that will open the door. Now, we could follow the path and, you know, mess up probably. Or we could actually long shot the torch. There's a, there's a wooden bit on the torch we can long shot to. There we go. And open the first door. Very nice. What's in here? Quivers! I like that. And magic! I like that too. So, here as you can see there is an orb. This orb is what's using the barrier. What we need to do is we need to use our light arrows here. So, just do that. Light arrow. And then simply fire at the orb. Sod you orb! Yay! And with that, we have destroyed the first, which was Impa. The shadow barrier is dispelled. Please save the princess. Thank you, Impa. Impa's going to use her power of shadowy shadowiness to uh, get rid of one of the barriers. We have like five to go at this point, but it's a good start. 
That's shadow I want just for the hover boots. Not a fan of that. Not a fan of that. So what we, what we could do is we could go to the next one, uh, which I usually like to do uh, either forest or fire next. Uh, but what we're actually going to do here is we are going to uh, leave, actually. We, we've done this and we're going to leave. Uh, there is a good reason for this, especially due to the fact that I haven't got much health. Well, I've got health, but sod it. So, we are going to go, we're going to go back out and leave. Goodbye. Uh, good, goodbye. There you go. Avoid the Beemos, because they're just going to be there to try and kill you. And you miss. Stupid Beemos. Ha ha. Victory for Link. And we're just going to leave. The reason is because there is something over here on the left that uh, we couldn't uh, get to before. But now with the golden gauntlets, we can get to it. So all is well there. So if we come over here, obviously there's a bunch of boulders here, and they don't really have much in them. Uh, but what is here is this. This sort of silver block. We can now use Link's... I mean, look, Link's just showing off now. Look at that. Massive, pretty much silvery block. Lob... Okay, no, that is showing off. Link! I really do feel like that those gauntlets are laced with steroids at this point. But anyway... Hey, the final Great Fairy's Fountain. And this one is a very useful one. So, let's get our ocarina out. There we go. Obviously, it plays Zelda's lullaby, of course. God, it's bloody hot in here as well. We're going to get news that um, the UK is going to hit 30 degrees at some point. And I'm just there going, it feels like about 40. Ugh. Anyway. So here is the, uh, the the final great fairy in the game for us. And my foot's going dead. Jeez, I'm just complaining about everything at this point. I'm a grumpy old man. Welcome, Link. I am the great fairy of courage. I'm going to enhance your defensive power. Receive it now. So she gives us something that's really, really useful. Um, it's not a spell. It's not, you know, uh, uh, an extra weapon. It's not anything else. It actually doubles our health pretty much. It reduces our damage by half. Pretty useful. Altogether, your defensive power is enhanced. Your defensive power has been enhanced. We just knew about that. Damage inflicted by enemies will be reduced by half. When battle has made you wary, please come back and see me. Well, thank you very much, Great Fairy. So, yes, if I was about to take, well, let's say, uh, four hearts of damage, which, yes, the, the, you know, like, I could take four hearts of damage like in one go. It'll only be two hearts of damage. So altogether, really, we have 40 health now instead of 20. So pretty good altogether. Anyway, now it's time to go back into Ganon's castle. Because sod that guy. He's about to die now. He's going to die now. He's going to die. So let's go round to our lovely uh, our lovely rainbow bridge. do 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 Yes, technically it is a rainbow road, really, isn't it? You know, speaking of that, I might want to let's play Mario Kart Double Dash at one point, but I suck at the game. It's racing games, not the best of those. Anyway, moving onward. So, uh, we did the uh, the shadow barrier first. I'm going to move around, but I'm going to save this one for last, which is the uh, the light barrier, in fact. So, there we go. Anyway, let's go into the fire barrier next, and uh, let's do this. Oh, yeah. So, um, in this area, you do need the Goron tunic on. So, we'll just switch to that so we don't burn to death. Um, also, we need the hover boots again. I'm just trying to use the hover boots and just get them out of the way, really. So, what really is supposed to happen is that some of these... Uh, sort of things, or some of these uh, platforms, do for some reason start falling. But for some reason it doesn't happen when you use the hover boots, which I'm perfectly okay with. There you go, just use some hover boots. And go to here. And we're going to want to lob this. Obviously, this is why you can't do this one first, because you need the golden gauntlets. There you just lob that over there. Go on, Link. Yeah! Ah, oh, he'd be great at the caber toss at some point. Yes, any Scots watching this? Go and get Link. He's actually pretty good. Anyway, moving onwards, we don't need that recovery hearts. So that's fine. 
We got it anyway. Damn that guy. Damn you. Oh, you didn't do too much damage. That's a fire snail here. Sod him. He's dead. Magic! Don't need that, but thanks. Alright. So yeah, pretty much it's time to get all of the rupees here. There's one over there I've noticed. Let's go and get that now. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Don't. Don't get burnt, Link. Damn it. Ow. 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 Yeah, you see, I'm... That would usually be a quarter heart of damage. I'm taking sort of like an eighth heart of damage on that. So that's fine by me, personally. I'm, I'm okay with that. There we go. After all that fire damage, I took like a... Like three quarters of a heart. Which ain't too bad. And last but not least, we're at the door. Oop, and... Dang it! Ah, oh, I messed up there. Alright, well, we've got to collect all the bloody rupees again. Oh, joy. Uh, do we? We've already collected the rupees. Does that mean the door's open? Oh, it is open! Wow, I thought they'd be dicks. They're not dicks. Well, not very often. The guys who make the game keep control, though, are dicks. Utter dicks. Ugh. Uh, move a little bit. Come on, Link. Do your best moving. Let's try now. Oh, I still can't hit it from here for some reason. Oh, no, I can. There you go. Sod that. Also, sod that guy for even attempting. Goon. And here is the next one. The good old fire orb. Once again, set up our, uh, our lovely light arrows. And um, smack it in the face. But we have pots here. Magic. Not the worst thing, yes. A heart. I was kind of hoping for quivers. Never mind. Take this! And with that all about the way, who's here but... Darunia! The fire barrier is dispelled! Hurry up, brother! Ah, no worries, brother. Do you know, Darunia's been one of my... sort of my... one of my favourite characters in, um... in Ocarina of Time. He's... he's been great. Darunia's been great. Let's be honest. All right, with that one out of the way, we can move on. Let's go to the next one. As I said, I'm going to leave the light one to last also. Please unequip the bloody hover boots. Please. You don't need them now. There we go. Now we can move a little bit quicker. All right, let's do the, uh, the this one here, which will be the spirit temple. Or the spirit one. Should I do the spirit one now? We ain't got a lot left, left in this video. No, we're going to do the forest one now, actually. Just to get out of the way. Plus, it's a pretty simple one. So, there we go. Also, it's going to use a lot of bleeding magic. So. Oh. It's a wolf boss. He's easy enough at this point. Have I got the Master Sword equipped? Why have I got that? Get off, Master Sword. No, I don't want to save. There you go, you the big Goron sword. That's better. There you go. You're just trying to make this bloody difficult for me. All right, we get a chest. What is in the chest? I wonder. Oh, quivers. Thank you. Going to be needing those because I'm going to be messing this up probably. Uh, go on, Link. Get to the. There you go. What have we got? Pointless, useless crap. All right. So we're gonna like, we need to light all these. We can use our arrows, but our arrows are important. Damn it! We're gonna need to use we're gonna want to use Din's fire here instead. So fire! And that lights all those torches. But there's one missing, which is uh, over here, just above the uh, the locked door. Um, so we're gonna want to use our fire arrows here. There we go to light the final torch. If I can actually bloody hit the thing. That'd be nice. Yeah! Got it that time! Hell yeah! <laughs> Alright. Oh, it's this one. Okay, yeah. We need to go back to the bleeding hover boots again! Bloody hover boots. Alright. We're gonna need to wait for the wind to start blowing. Alright, we'll wait a little. I just noticed we could probably song a time there. That's fine. No, we, don't, we don't want to do that. We might do, though. Go on. Start blowing, damn it. There we go. Go! Yeah! Made it. 
Alright. Now we're going to want to go to that switch over there. Yes. And rolling on that. Beamos. Sod off, Beamos. I will lob a bomb at you and kill you. I will. I should have killed the Beamos first. Now, well, I forgot about it. A bit late now. I think I'm out of the Beamos' range. That's pretty good. Alright, so. Anyway, the Beamos doesn't do much damage now with our defensive capabilities. Alright, we're going to want to use the long shot here, obviously, to long shot to that platform there. Thank you. That's that one. Now what we're going to want to do... Um, if I could see what was going on, maybe hover boots to there. No, we're gonna we're gonna wanna we're gonna wanna uh, destroy that bee most definitely. So we'll use a bomb for that. Bomb! Yeah, take that bee most bastard. All right, we're we gonna go back to the hover boots again. I think. Are they certain? I can smell bacon in my house. It's actually quite nice. Yes, we are. Oh, God. No, no, no. Don't miss this up. Don't, 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 don't. All right. This one. Yeah. And over here. And over here. Boom. And the last one. All right. We're going to want to, uh, once again, equip our Kakiri boots here. So we don't get blown over by this git bag over there. We don't want that, obviously. We've got a nice run up as well. We'll just wait. We'll just wait a little bit for that to go. And then we'll be okay. Hurry up. Come on. I ain't got all night. Actually, I do. I want to get this Let's Play done before that, though. Oh, God. I was... I, I, I was... I was set the wrong way. Well, bugger. On that part. But it did open the door. So that's that's all that matters to me. So, there we go. We'll just long shot here. Boom. Yeah, I want to go on this. Just to kill the blasted Beemos. Sod you. Yeah. All right, so with his amazing eye falling down slowly, no! We'll, uh, we'll just hover over here, if you don't mind. Uh, then go here. And then up here, and through the door! Yeah, well, I'm happy I, they don't reset the room. That would be a bit annoying. All right. What's in here? Magic! It's actually really useful. I'll take it. What's in here? Hearts. That's kind of less useful. But I'll take it regardless. So, with that out of the way, once again, we just equip our light arrows. And then, fire! Yeah! And there we go, we have done three of the, uh, of these areas here. Just, uh, three to go. The forest barrier is dispelled. Hurry up, Link. I know, I know. Ugh. Alright, sorry, I get it. Alright, but with that, we have unlocked three of the uh, the barriers. We have three left. And there we go. Deactivated barrier. Anyway, guys, I'm going for a break here. But the next episode, let's play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. We get the other three barriers. I'll see you then.